Okay, you guys, so I am on my fourth drawer of the Alex five drawer unit, and my big plan is to try to fit my foundations, baby creams, powders, and lip products into this drawer. That may or may not happen. That is my big goal. Um, I've already gotten rid of that much makeup. Watch my other two previous videos to see me go through that. Um, but so this is what I have for foundations and then lip products. So I'm trying to put that all into one drawer. And this is one of the deeper drawers in the Alex five drawer unit. I have this in here um, because I think that this will work well for like my foundations and stuff. But I'm not sure if I'll keep this in here. We will see. But um, also... I'm in a bit of a time crunch. We are going to go to dinner soon, so I have to try to work on this as much as I can before we leave, so hopefully I can do the whole drawer before that. So let's go, speedy time. able to do it. This is all of my foundations, powders, and all of my lip products. I still would like to get um, like lipstick organizers so they can all be standing up. That probably will happen in the next like month that I'll get that, but all of this stuff fits into one drawer. I am so freaking excited. So um, over here, I have this little four compartment plastic thing. So I have my bourgeois foundations, a BB cream fits here, then I have my other BB creams in this quadrant, my um, wet n wild coverall, and a powder. And then here, this one doesn't really fit, like it can't stand up, it's too tall. Um, so I just have it laying here. Then I have two of my Physicians Formula Healthy Wears, um, a Bourjois powder that I can't wait to use, and a Revlon. So this is my little face base section. So I can't believe it's just in one little section. I'm so excited. And then this compartment, um, I used this in my last organizational um, system for my eyeshadows. But um, this is from... Target. It has one large section, two rectangles here, and three squares over here. So I basically kept it um, like color coordinated. 
like I had in my last system, but then I also separated it by brand for some of it. So like here I have all of my MUA One Direction Kiss You lipsticks and my Too Faced La Creme. Here I have all of my Rimmel um, Moisture Renew and a Bourjois Rouge Edition. Back here I have the L'Oreal um, Color Riche Balms, a... Um, Maybelline and a Revlon. Then in this section, I have all of my lip glosses right here. So I have the YSL one that Sam gave me, Orange de Chine. Oh my gosh, so fancy. Um, an All May Cantaloupe gloss, um, NYX Butter gloss, and then some other glosses. Then over here, I have two Maybelline Vivids, two L'Oreal's, a Revlon, and two like crayon style lip products. Here are all of my corals. So I have Wet n Wild, um, Maybelline, MAC, MUA, and then over here are all of my darks. And I also have my OCC mini lip tars. They fit perfectly here. So I have my reds and my vampire colors. So OMG guys, yay. And this is the stuff that I'm getting rid of. Um, some of my lip products. And some of these I'm going to throw out like these Revlon ones. They're just so freaking old. Um, but yeah, I'm so excited. I can't believe this. So, um, let me just do an overview of every drawer. So if you want to see all of them, um, you can see them. So here is the first drawer, which is cream shadows and liners. Oh, and also I put birch box lids back here so the stuff won't like slide as much um so there's that that was in the first video this drawer is my blushes bronzers and highlights which was also in the first video and i condensed that collection a lot then this is my favorite drawer oh eyeshadows this was my third my second video i mean oh my god it's beautiful and then this video of course was lips and face products and there's just a little bit of space back there that I might put um, something so stuff doesn't slide but oh my god and then I have this drawer that's empty if I could get it out um, which I have like some of my miscellaneous stuff here and like over here I have backup so I think I'm going to try to fit those in that final drawer um, and I'll have that as the last video in this mini series but I can't believe how much I've been able to get done today I've done all of those drawers today um, and just divided it into um, three separate videos so far and then the last video will be the last drawer and then probably like my top like um, figuring out what to do for like the top organization but oh my god you guys i'm so excited this is like such a great purchase and now all of my makeup fits into four drawers what that is crazy so i'm super excited let me show you all of the stuff together that i am getting rid of because this is nuts oh let me try not to fall over everything okay so this is all of the makeup that I decided to part with today. So all of this, all of these lip products, and all of these eyeshadows. OMG. I cannot wait to pass this on to people that will use it more, to throw out the old stuff. I just can't believe how amazing this has felt and um, I'm so excited. And like I said, I'm going to put in this corner, in that box, is like a dressing, sort of like hanging unit. So I'm going to put that there and I think it'll look cuter. Um, oh my god, I'm just so excited. So I hope you guys have enjoyed these videos. Like I said, my last drawer will just be like sort of miscellaneous stuff, backups, skincare, um, whatever else I can fit in it. Um, so stay tuned for that. But thank you so much for coming along with me on this journey because it... It was definitely hard to part with some of these things, especially my eyeshadows. Oh god, I have such like an attachment to every one, but um, I just now have all the ones that I truly love, so I'm so excited about that. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you have been enjoying this, and stay tuned for my next video, so I'll see you then. Bye!